It is that green, grainy glow that you see in footage from nighttime battles or in action movies. It's called night vision, and tonight's good question, how does it work? So here's what it looks like in a room with the lights on. Now let's turn the lights off and we'll put the image intensification on. The latest generation of night vision can turn night into day. Well, greenish day. Changes photons of light into electrons, multiplies them, throws them against a the phosphor screen, and recreates the image. So you're actually not looking through the binoculars, you're looking at a green tinted um, recreation of the image. James Munn of American Technologies Network says the image is green because the phosphor is green, a color that is good for the human eye to pick up detail. Thermal imaging, on the other hand, looks white. And it picks up the infrared light that all objects emit. The hotter the object, the whiter the image. Cooler temperatures, like glass, appear black. So if I put my sunglasses on, I can't see my eyes. Mm, correct. Right? So you're not going to be able to see the eyes, you're not going to be able to see through windows. Thermal imaging can't see through walls, but it's useful for law enforcement, for hunters, and of course, soldiers who also use the tried and true green variety. Paul, my cameraman's going to tell me how many fingers I'm holding up right now. Paul? You got two. And how about now? Three. I guess you can see me. Send us your good question at cbs5.com.